Alright, let's continue. I have uh, muted the music because it's a Sunward game, because Sunward Games has developed it, and their music always has copyright problems, so I'ma just mute it now, so I don't have to deal with that. We have some bones, a wolf symbol, a dagger lock, which is an Uroboros, which is a snake biting its own tail, which exists in a symbol that exists in a lot of cultures. In Norse mythology, that would be Midgard's Urman, or the Midgard... Is it called the Midgard snake in English? I don't even know. Uh, empty gun, parts of code, and a necklace piece. And what are we doing on this ship? It's so quiet now. Without the music, but I need the music to be gone. Otherwise, I get the copyrights. And I don't. I don't feel like dealing with that. Is that not a shell? Maybe. Apparently, it wasn't. Okay, I have to be like extra entertaining now because it's all quiet and awkward. Hallelujah. Wait, what am I doing here? Yes. Oh. Wait, I still need four? No, three. Okay. Still. Eh, that was a shell. That was a shell. Oh, there, there were two obvious. Conch. Cool. Uh, the right symbol opens his lantern. For wolves, we have uh, Fiendris Ulven. Fenris wolf? I don't even know how to say these things in English, I just realized. Oh, oh well. Uh, I think you'll, you'll, you'll need some, some parts, yo. So, um, here. Ahoy, stranger. Oh, wow. We'll gladly take you to the Lost Isle, but we can't cast off with my drum and my fellow oarsmen falling to pieces. If you put them back together, We'll take you wherever you like. For some reason, reason that dead person didn't sound very convincing to me. I was just like, uh huh. Sure you will. Uroboros, here we go. Um. Oh yeah, collectibles. There's nothing here. It seems. We have a code. Oh, you can have this, actually. Apparently I want that. Um... Oh, that is a thing. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh, I get it. Um, except the other way around. There we go. Okay, picking things up. Uh, why is this codex chained? It's probably a reasonable explanation. This gate reminds me of the one mentioned in Peter's re research. <coughs> I'm gonna go on a wild guess that it's probably because it is the gate in Peter's research. Here we go. For some reason this goblet filled with acid is not crumbling in the acid or whatever. Okay. Well, good thing we almost died there. Most cages have locks, right? Not necessarily. But I guess. Clenched arm bone. Okay. We have all the bone parts, apparently. So. Uh, sealed codex. The golem was created to carry out orders for its owner. Its heart can be started by the water of life. 
Since it's secured, it must contain important information. Could be a hoax. I don't know. Um, you might need this. Oh, wow, we're gonna build you now. That... Can you stop rotating, please? Um, that is an arm. So we'll put that up here. Your legs, we'll put you there. And you don't want an upside down face. Um, there we go. The drum needs a skin to make noise. Okay. We can go backwards. I don't remember this. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh. This randomly strung up piece of leather here. Sure, why not? I think we got all the collectibles. I'm pretty sure I did that last time and we haven't really... There are no, like, new areas, so... We're fine. Apparently, yeah, apparently the little friends or whatever they are called flameblings, according to the achievements. Um, and someone told me in the comments another name for them, and I'm sorry, I can't remember that right now, but... Go with, with flame blings. I'm sure there's amazing music here, but it's all muted. the crew to sail. I think this is not lit up, right? I could catch that with a fishing rod. Are you sure about that? This must have been abandoned for a long time. Oh. Oh. Strange person. Hello. So, you want to improve Hard's innocence? We were good friends once. If you summon Frigg, she will surely help you. I'll keep the wolves at bay, but I don't know how long I'll last without the help of my golem. Perhaps you could finish fixing him for me. Here is my house key. You're friends with her? Then who are you? Oh, I thought it said Disney key for a second. I was like, what? Druid's key. Who? Who are you? Because, like, if you're friends with her, then who was a god who lived in Asgard? Who was an Asgard, I guess. Um, which sounds horrible in English, I know, but still. Also good. Like, I don't. I don't think Helder ventured out of there much because, like, he couldn't see, and apparently th the other gods didn't think of, like, I don't know, giving him some sort of help to get around. As far as I know, so like, maybe he didn't want to get around, but like, you would have to be a giant or a god to be friends with him, I guess. Like. All this ivy blocks the recess. Like, although what pointy ears, but like... Okay, but elves in Norse mythology isn't really elves in like... Tolkien stories, like... They're not really big humanoids. So, like, I'm just confused about who this person was, is. All these spikes, yikes. Raising the water level might be the best solution. Um, I guess. Okay, it's a druid, but, like. Uh, 
a druid? I don't think Norse mythology and like Scandinavian culture has druids. That sounds like maybe Samic and like Celtic or like like Finland Russia type of stuff like druid. I don't know maybe it's just a translation but like druid does not sound very Scandinavian. All right, well, that was an interesting puzzle. <laughs> Joe's house. Oh, wait a minute. Was there a collectible out here? Yes. Something. Oh, I start. I stopped paying attention. Uh, I saw you morph. Come on. I actually saw you morph. Now morph back. Thank you. There's something more. Okay, I'm guessing it's a flame bling. Apparently they come in four colors. There's a purple one. There we go. And there's like a an achievement for getting all of them of each color. Uh, I saw you. I saw, I saw you change. I swear I saw you change. There. Okay, and there's a flame bling as well. Ah, yellow. That's why I can't see you. How can I figure out what to do? Well, suppose the top part of the symbol snapped off. Wait, is that you? No. There's a kitty cat. <laughs> yes, you can actually bribe cats. Um, if you do it, like a cat that does, and you have it home and it doesn't like you, you can actually do like a bribing strategy, but you have to do it like over time or whatever to make it trust you but that that works but it looks so nice uh, I can't open it without the complete not wait what was this stairs symbol oh okay it's part of some stairs somewhere interesting um, I don't think I was done out here though this is a golem oh here we go I guess heart is broken quite literally his heart needs to be replaced um, looks like some weapons are hidden here okay don't have that. What is this? Vial. Oh, fishing rod. Okay. Cemetery. Uh, Hoogin or Mooning, I guess. Ooh! Draugs. Which are like. Um. For folklore zombies, I guess. It's like. Oh, there's a flame light. Um. Like the dead rising again, which, um was a reason for sometimes when apparently they uh, put the dead into the, like when they um oh, what's it called wow I can't remember what it's called when they put the dead down into the earth which I can't remember right now in English what that's called um they would like behead them so that they wouldn't walk again or you could drive a stake through them which has nothing to do with vampires but just like if you drive a stake through it through the body then it will like hold it in place I think and there was a couple like stuff like that so that you wouldn't get a draug um, what can be hidden behind this stone tablet May maybe we will never know but we probably will uh, the light that works best here is probably magical how do you even know a light goes there Oh no, I know bees dislike smoke. These pillars look like an ancient burial place. Do they? Also, again, if this is supposed to be Sweden, like, I'm a skeptical. <laughs> I'm skeptical. Like, I, obviously, they haven't said anything in-game. This could be anywhere, just with Norse mythology. Because, like, 
I'm skeptical. <laughs> I, I am. <laughs> where, where is this exactly? <laughs> but, uh, sure, absolutely. I mean, I don't know everything about Sweden, though I live here. Absolutely not, so. It could be totally legit, and I just don't understand. I, I don't know about it, but. But, like, it doesn't. The nature is wrong. Like, not even, not even the burial site, because that could be some weird thing, sure. Um, but, like, the nature is wrong. Which, which is fine. Like, again, it's just because it says in the, like, if you read about this game on Steam, for example, it says that the letter from Peter was from Sweden. Like, so, I presume Peter was in Sweden, right? But, so... That would mean that this is potentially supposed to be Sweden, but no one has actually said anything about that. But if it is, this ain't no Sweden I've ever seen. A good blast of air would really ha help raise this diving equipment. Okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, I know I saw something with the skull symbol. Oh, 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 now I remember. Now I remember. Good kitty. Um. I could pry this out with something spiky. <laughs> what? <coughs> what? <coughs> oh my god. I can pry this out with something spiky. That's like oddly specific. It's like an odd sentence. Like not grammatic, just like, what? You can pry something out with something spiky? I don't know, is this spiky enough for you? I don't want to break the glass. Well, if you do it with something spiky, you're definitely gonna break the glass. Like, I thought I thought that was something spiky would do. Wouldn't it? Okay, I have like, a no, no things really. Oh wait, can I just like, no? Why not? Okay, map. Um, seashore. Oh, I see. Oh, we actually haven't. No, actually, we have. Never mind. I was gonna say we haven't haven't seen all this episode, but we have actually. I'm not even looking down here what I need. I was just like, I see suspicious amount of, like, starfish. Okay, actually, I saw the frogs. But, like, starfish, butterflies, that was a moth, but sure. Glowing crystal parts. Oh. Okay. Um. And now, the cemetery. Is this a magical light? It is a magical light. Bye, draugs. I don't remember what you're supposed to do if you meet a draug. Like, if there's any way to, like... Because they're really strong. I remember that. So it's like, you don't want to get into, I don't know, a wrestling fight with them or something. But, uh, I don't remember what you can do to keep safe. Hello. I don't think you're supposed to be there. Like, this is getting- this is giving me- the parts of this is getting- giving me a more of, like, Britain, Celtic vibes, but, I mean, I could be completely wrong about that, too. I know- I, I know- I definitely know less about that. Um... Wait, empty smoker, but I can do something. Oh, okay. Okay, hairpin. 
Now this, if this is actually spiky, this is gonna be hilarious. We need, we need to do- Oh my god, the hairpin is actually sp considered spiky. I still don't think that's the English word you're looking for. Like, I, I get what you're going for, but like, sadly, it was close, but not exactly the adjective you were, you were going for. It, it, it wasn't. Statue Eye? What? Oh well, we'll figure that out in the next episode. Because this one is <coughs> up. So thank you all very much for watching, and I'll see ya.